Hello Aries, this is Inspire 2016 with your monthly reading for the month of December 2017 focusing on your career and work life. I hope that you have a good time uh, in the month of November. So let's see what is in store for you for next month, for the month of December. So the first card for you representing the present position towards the beginning of the month, you have the Queen of Diamond. So this card indicates for me that there will be a male significant figure in your life, possibly from the earth sign uh, figure in your life. She can be uh, in the mid 20s or early 30s years old. So it can be somebody along those lines that she can be somebody that are significant in the beginning of the month. She could be the hiring manager or she could also be a recruiter that are looking for candidates like you or looking for people with your skills with your knowledge and and those type of things and she want to get in touch with you so there's something that you want to deal with as well other than that if you not looking for a new job so this person can be somebody that are significant in your in your team or somebody that are giving you a lot of contributions or a lot of like new ideas and new things in your current uh, projects so it looks like she can be a good contributor and she can be a very important part of your projects <clears throat> so the next card that you have representing the uh, influence card or the bridge card over the middle of the month you have the ace of spade so this card indicates a, a lot of different things. So it can be uh, representing that uh, can be the hiring process has been going through and you may get a call back for another interview and things like that. So these kind of uh, cards could also be indicating that you will be getting a good feedback in terms of your career situations here or you may get a good news in terms of your uh, like hiring situations or, or things like that so it doesn't mean that you get a job straight away but for some of you may have been getting those uh, uh, straight away but the thing is that most of you you may takes a longer time so uh, I know this is can be a quite a stressful time if you have been trying to find a new job but in some way you know it's very hard to to get it to get it through and you know you may have to wait for quite some time and, and those type of things so and also at the same time this the this month will be the very uh, busy month as well and also quite festive month so it's kind of hard to you know to find the 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 whole things finalizing before the end of the year so However, though, the, the, this card indicates that there will be a new beginning for some of you about the new job that you have been uh, wanting for a long time. So some something that you really want to happen in your life. So finally, uh, it comes. So the next card that you have representing the past position of your career spread, you have the Jack of Diamond. So this check of diamond representing a younger person in your life, possibly male or female from the earth sign. So again, this could be somebody that bringing you news uh, towards this queen of diamonds. Because it's in the same suit of diamond, it does look like it's regarding your money. It can also be regarding your jobs as well. So it can be like uh, the recruitment processes has been you know started since uh, possibly in, in November or October but it may not have been a, like finalized straight away because possibly like you have to wait for uh, for the application to go through the hiring uh, the, the hiring manager and then from hiring manager go to the direct manager and blah blah blah, blah and you may have to wait for that so this is something that you have uh, aware of we've been aware of for quite some time in the past and it's something that you want to you know like finding out uh, the decisions for some of you who have been thinking to go back to school this can also be indicated that as well 
So the next slide that you have representing the things that you need, uh, that you learn from the past, you have the four of heart. So this opportunity can be more than one, by the way. It doesn't have to be only one. So for some of you who have been getting a lot of different offer, for some of those offer may not something that you are looking for. So be aware this that this card doesn't mean that all of those opportunity are not genuine. It doesn't mean that all of those um, opportunity or offer is not really something that you want, but some of those are something that you don't want but most of these uh, the one that you don't want will not go through until this stage but something that you really want it will go through until this stage as easy as that that's something that you learn that that you know what do you want exactly so the next that you have presenting the things that you need to let go from the past you have the ten of spades so this card indicates something that has been ended in your life. It could also be some uh, kind of contract or some kind of term of agreement or things like that regarding your career. So this card could also be indicating for some of you who have been let go by your employer. So this card could also be indicating that there is a termination of the contract that you have uh, aware of. It doesn't mean that this is something that you don't know or something that you are not really aware of. This is something that you really know that you are aware of. It's because you, this is nothing that surprised you. So this is something that you really know that you do are ended up in the end of the cycle. But the, the, the true message here, the truth of the matter is that you need to let go this ending. There's nothing that you can do in this case and just like holding into this type of uh, situation may not giving you any good results as well at the same time just have to let it go and let it let let's just move on so the next card that you have the representing your future card or towards the end of the month you have the five of diamond uh, this card can be a quite a stressful one because sometimes you may have a lot of expectations and you know like there is a loss of the job can be indicated by this card in the past that you have for some of you who finally let go some of your employments and then you finally get into point that you know what this is not really the one that you want so for some of you it can also be indicated that like you don't you, in the end, after you decided to go to the new path, but in the end, in the new path, you finally realize that this is not the path that you want to 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 work for quite a long time, and it's also quite also another stressful time of the year. So let me clarify those cards. Okay, from this card indicates that there is a good sense of moving forward in your career life. And by the same time, there is some connection within you towards the other people in your life from the past. And there is another news coming in that representing a quiet sense of uh, beginning. So it does look like that the, the beginning of a new cycle here doesn't mean it, it will happen in the month of December <clears throat> but towards the end of the month it looks like you have another offer coming in from the people from the past that are trying to get through you again for some of you that may indicate that like if you have been unemployed for quite a while and then you know what uh, your previous employer finally uh, you know needs somebody and then this employer remember you as a person has with a has with a quite a good quality, and this person may contact it you back in the month of December, for possibly by the end of the month of December. It's quite odd though, but in the end, it looks makes sense because it just looks like that you finally you have been there and you have known the way how it works before with your previous employer and you finally decided okay i will be back and i will go back and work with for you again that is something that you can be uh, experiencing towards the end of the month
Oh, of course, this will not be resonate with all of you, but the thing is most for some of you, it will be in this uh, scenario. So let's see, let's clarify the whole uh, reading here. At the bottom of the deck, you have the Queen of Spades. Okay, so this card can also be representing somebody from the past. So this queen can be somebody that offer you this opportunity back again. So this can be quite doubtful and stressful if you get this five of diamonds in your reading. But however, there is a help for you from this queen of spades. She wants to offer you help and helping hand so that there is an offer here coming from the past which is from this queen and that gives you a lot of help towards your career and give you a new hope or a new sense of a new beginning uh, i hope that this reading is helpful for you and if this reading is uh, resonate with you just click like and if you want to get in touch just click the link below and if you haven't subscribed already just click to subscribe and it may take some time for us to get back to you but please be patient and see you next year thank you